So, uh, Margaret, what's the biggest challenge when you were creating the Child uh, Migrant Trust? Oh, getting people to believe me. No one believe you? Uh, well, of course not. There's been a lot of denial about child migration schemes and the havoc that it played with children's lives and families. And how, how did you go about changing the mindset of governments and, and ministers? Well, it, of course, it took 23 years, and I think that's the sort of thing that we feel very concerned about at the moment. There's something that was so that we could have done something about 23 years ago. And government funding was so limited, and there was such a sense of denial that this hadn't happened. How could we have done this? Um, so, look, two things we had to do is to reunite people with their families as quickly as we could, and alongside that, of course, inform government, lobby, advocate, and, uh, and of course, uh, the culmination of that was uh, uh, last year when Gordon Brown apologised on behalf of the nation, which was quite a critical landmark, actually. What did it actually feel like when you saw Gordon Brown apologise? Well, I thought, I mean, for child migrants, of course, and their families, and that's what this is all about, it was that moment that they'd waited for for so long, that recognition that their country had been involved in the deportation of children, separating them from their families, telling them they were orphans when they definitely were not. So it was a you know, big milestone for them. For the Trust, um, again, I think for the Trust, at a much lesser extent, it was that acknowledgement, that, uh, yeah, acknowledgement of our work. And what does it feel like to be at cause for reuniting so many families? Look, I think the work of reuniting families, particularly separated under these circumstances, is very, it requires very skilled work. Um, but I mean, look, this is what the Trust is all about. That's the heart of this project. Families, restoring them, trying to deal with, uh, with this past.